Our gathering here this morning is yet a further affirmation of the commitment of the Okufuado government to provide the police service with the necessary logistics it requires to help the service continue to effect its mandate of maintaining law and order and protecting lives and property. The most important things for a nation are the peace and safety of its people and its territorial integrity. It is when these are guaranteed the citizens can go about their lives in security and hope to improve upon the quality of their circumstances. We all feel safe and are able to undertake our day-to-day -day activities when we are assured of the peace and safety of our nation. We all sleep without a care in the world when we know the men and women of the police service are working to keep our communities and our streets safe. Today, I pay tribute to you, officers, men, and women of the police service for your dedication to the nation. It is for these reasons the government continues to cooperate with the police service and is committed to giving whatever support is required to ensure that we have the service that is fit for purpose and one that the people of Ghana deserve. The police service has embarked on a transformation agenda aimed at positioning the service to become one of the best institutions in the country, if not the best, and a model institution for the rest of the world. This laudable initiative, which seeks to regain the confidence, trust, and the respect of the public, and deepen poli police legitimacy has the full backing of government. An institution such as the police service needs to renew constantly itself in order to respond adequately to the security needs of the country. And I believe Ghanaians are witnesses to the pragmatic steps being taken by the service in this regard. Mm -hmm.